In his day, Sokolov was Dunwall's genius. He transformed our city with his inventions. Electricity for the factories and carriages racing along above the streets. As I grew up, his buzzing and glowing devices kept me safe. His stories always made me giggle, and his outrageous conversation shocked aristocrats and overseers alike. Now, all these years later, Kieran Jindosh is Karnaka's genius. A mad inventor who has given the Duke sinister machines that move like people but aren't. Clockwork soldiers that fight and kill. I've got to find out where Sokolov's being held and bring the old man back alive. Rescue one genius and cage the other before he creates an army of clockwork soldiers. Hey, how's it going? Good to have you back and welcome to the excellent Dishonored 2 Brian playthrough and we've completed the Good Doctor mission at long last and now we're on to the Clockwork mission, or Clockwork Mansion mission, sorry, in search of the Good Doctor Anton Sokolov and I'm guessing the game is about to start up in the ante so uh, let's just crack on and get it done. Okay, Doctor Patient needed a place to sleep, so I cleared stuff out of the spare cabin. I was able to sell most of it. Here's what's left of the money. It's not a lot, I know. Why well, always expensive and imperial rationing degree, but you know that. Megan Foster. Okay. Okay, let's just do the diary thing. I think it's important to do this. I don't know why. But I'll just cut it out at the end uh, of the editing. So yeah, if you see any weird cuts, it's either I've been killed a thousand times trying to work out how to do something, or it's just not relevant. Okay, so, okay, no weird place at the end of the room. What is it they say up in Tivia? Watch the faces of those who bow the most deeply. You might want to talk to Hypatia before we head out. She's taken one of the rooms, just for a while, I think. Needed to be away from Ademeyer. Okay. Grand Guard. Oh, you're here. Stay with me a moment. Dr. Hypatia, can you remember anything that might help me? I need to find Anton Sokolov. He could be the key to unraveling the Duke's plans. My memories are disjointed. The Duke is close to his grand inventor, Kirin Jindosh. But that man has the empathy of a mantis. He seems to both admire and despise Sokolov. We visited Aramis Stilton. I liked him. But something bad happened. Just snatches a memory. Sorry. You should rest easy for a while. Maybe some of that will help. I hope so. I'm not sure I even fully understand what you did for me, but I owe you for helping me at Ademeyer. Thank you. Oh, you're welcome. Oh. Hold. Yeah, top up and take one of those. Nom nom. Okay, is there anything in here? On a boat with friends, I believe I slept thankfully without the usual nightmares. Perhaps the sea does me good. Captain Megan Foster brought some tea earlier. Such an interesting woman. She seems to understand about my strange, disjointed memories. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. I kind of hope she'd give me Maybe something nice, actually. Day. Okay, oh, that's uh, my room. Yep, nothing in here. I just little run around to see what's going on. See if anything's respawned.
toilet, nothing in there. Ramsey and the crown killer. Two pieces of the puzzle. More to go. Delilah. My aunt, if that's really true. She has a twisted way of looking at the world. To reach Jindosh, I'll have to take the carriage through Lower, then Upper Aventa. Okay, well there's a clue anyway. Oh, you've got mission markers, so okay, who cares. Right. What else is happening? Anything else to pick up? Can we get in here yet? Damn it. I know there's something good in there. Okay, let's go have a chat with old Megan. Let's hope your friend doesn't sink the boat while we're gone. Ready? Yeah, let's crack on. Um, all right, let's get underway. Jindosh is important to the Duke's inner circle. The Grand Guard watches his mansion, and they'll call down the entire city if they find out who you are. I'll make sure they don't. You said there's a wall of light cutting off access to the carriage station? Yes. But there's a black market shop nearby. They sell on the sly. Ever use a rewiring tool? Corvo taught me the theory. Good. Get past the wall of light, then ride the carriage to where Jindosh lives. And there's a reason people are afraid of his mansion. I'll get it done. I'm gonna take care of this crazy man and his clockwork soldiers, then bring Sokolov back. He means a lot to me. Well, you could give me a lot more information than a few cryptic clues. Why are people scared of his mansion? That'd be nice to know. Oh well. Okay, let's see what's lying around here. Come on, come on, get up, get up. There you go. Raw whalebone, nom nom. Okay. I wonder what you want that for. I think in one of the powers it actually shows you um, loose wood objects. I think I might get that. Because I've got a horrible feeling I keep on missing stuff. Outsider shrine. Okay, we'll try and hit that first if we can. Yeah, a few more runes, and I should be getting a decent, I'll be able to do decent combinations with the powers. Okay. 
Okay, so let's uh, get a rewire tool at the black market shop. Okay. Yeah, time for a quick save, I think. But as I look out from the windows of the Grand Palace, I know these are lies. Oh, that's close. It's true that across our capital city there are buildings full of blood flies. There have always been blood Okay, right, that's what we go for first then. Okay, lock the room. Lovely jubbly, that's locked in. Okay, so we'll go through here up to higher Avante. Avante or whatever it's called. Sneaky, sneaky. Yeah, let's put them away just in case we alarm some of the citizens. And uh, well, no more, thank you. Place is a dump anyway. Somebody seen something. Now we're all on edge. My heart can't take much more of this. Ah, I wonder if that's why I'm always missing so much money on the uh, at the end. I'm not pickpocketing people. I can't not pick a thousand pieces of gold. Hold on. Brilliant bluff flies, fantastic. I mean, they're not hard to deal with, but they don't freak me out. They, they, they will freak, creep me out, I think, not freak me out. Ah, uh, let's just get to it. Deal with that one down there. Go on. Go on. I should quiet them down a little bit. Nom nom. Go on, bugger off. Ah oh, man, they're everywhere. Okay. I don't think there's any way around this. Let's just go in. Balls out. Good night, good night. Go on, go away. Horrible little things. Okay. I know they're not attacking me now, but they still bug the hell out of me. Right, so where are we? Start looting in peace now. Lucky it's a fun nom nom. Okay, it's upstairs.
I really don't like him. <laughs> okay. Yeah, you guys can uh, pause the uh, the video if you want to read this stuff. I'm kind of reading it, but uh, I'll cut it out in video editing if it's if I don't think it's really important. Oh, pouch, nom nom, coin, nom nom. Oh, sleep darts, nom nom. Okay, so, uh, where's the shrine? Go upstairs. Uh, can we climb through there? Uh. Nope. Damn it. Can we get through there? Oh, job done. Oh, there you go. what his story is oh yeah it's down in the letter they were trying to get through to the void and trying to uh, draw power from it he was in guys did an experiment so you can free you can pause that um, letter before that tells you all about it what they're trying to do these little glimpses of the void describes and those waken this must be a real place not a folklore but when so revealed I will not be so fearsome place any longer distant special realm described in the myth of the outsider will be strange yes even unsettling but nonetheless it will be whatever so you can pause that if you want to read it no just read that Rooms. I'll tell you a story about Kirin Jindash, a prodigy from Karnaka. Self-taught, he was hailed by the Academy of Natural Philosophy as a genius who would surpass Sokolov and bring about an age of enlightenment. But just two years after his arrival, he was banned from the Academy for life for reasons that are still not public. When they deported him, he left behind a machine that drank seawater, playing music that brought listeners to tears. They probably took it apart, and it has never worked since. Yeah. 
Okay, so let's have a look at the powers then. We've got five. Oh, I think that one could be quite handy. You see, these two would be good as well. And that one shows you all the... Uh, I think it shows you alarms and, and stuff to be looted. So it gives me two. Um, yeah, that looks like it could be handy, that one. And it's only one rune. Yeah, we'll do it. I think we'll be picking up a fair few uh, runes on this one anyway, so uh, yeah, it's got to be worth it. Okay. So, oh, there you go. Fifteen nom nom. Oh, it just shows you I missed that. Okay, so I think we've got the black market just down there. Uh, obviously, we want to go there. I'll buy another room. So and a bone charm just across the road. Yeah, I have to go for the bone charm first. Okay, can I get down there? Oh, the range on this isn't great. Oh, damn it, I didn't mean to do that. Well, it works anyway. <laughs> it works. Get up there and should hop onto the balcony from there. That should just about do it. Okay, quick save. I can't peek through this one. Painting there. That's me, Ramsey Stockhurst, whoever the hell he is. Oh, pouch, nom 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 nom. So, oh, 150 gold, nom nom. Uh, thank you for your help. Without you, it would have been impossible to trace the final member of the Grand Guard who were with Stilton that night three years ago. Last night, I made it all the way to North Maya, if you can believe it, and was recovering a civilian asylum for the poor, claiming to have seen all manner of strange things. So, your bank agent's name, da, da, da. Brianna Ashworth. Okay, so something's happened to some bloke called Stilton, and she's been hunting down the last witnesses. Whoever she is. The plot thickens. It's a bone, bone charm. Robust. Let's have a little look see. Okay. And robust. 
Alexis restore slightly more health. Yeah. Nothing fantastic there. And I don't think I want any of these corrupt, uh, well, corrupt ones. Yeah, that doesn't seem to be an issue to me, so uh, they seem to restore enough health anyway. Maybe later on. Anyway, I've got it. So, yeah. Okay, have we missed anything? Well, it doesn't let me pick them up. Alright, so this basically highlights things you can interact with, which I don't understand then why it highlights those two swords, because you can't do anything with them. Yeah, very strange. Anyway, let's crack on. Let's get to that black bloody market. One there, one there, one up there. Just one, two, three, four. Four that I can see. Why would he say that? Makes no sense. Yeah, I might have to be a bit sneaky with this one. Yeah, hopefully these guys just don't look up. Is it down there? Okay. No. Okay, this must be around the corner here. Quick, 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 quick. Okay, it's just around the corner. Quick save. I smell danger. Okay, I think this is it. Yep, that's the black market. Okay. Oh, damn it, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> if you're not oh, with the guard, fingers. I'm happy to serve. I don't know you. I'm new to Karnaka. I need a tool that can rewire a wall of light. The kind the Grand Guard uses. And I'd prefer not to explain myself. I can help you out, but not right now. Don't even linger here. I'm supposed to get a visit from Paolo, someone you don't want to meet. Come back later. Understood. You should go. We can do business another time. Like I said, Paolo is coming by. Okay, so uh, let's hide. Where can you hide? Up there? Oh, I can hear him coming. I can hear him coming. Damn it. Oh, that's not going to work. Okay, let's uh go for a swim if I didn't know how many corpses that were rotting in the canals. <coughs> They're a healthy bunch in this this uh, game, aren't they? Ooh, wonder what's up there. Short blades, good stuff. 
Is that here? That's good. Okay, so obviously he's a local heavy. Okay, right, let's go and get this thing done. Ooh, what was up here? Absolutely bloody nothing. I sleep in the shop most nights. The city's not safe. It's too late to run. I'm begging you, hide until Paolo's gone. He'll hurt you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You already told us that. He's gone. Don't worry. Okay, so... Greetings. I serve with discretion. Okay, right. So, we've got upgrades. Let's have a look at these. Into sleep dance. Immolates an enemy. Things were so much better just a decade ago. Right, so I'm guessing we're going to go up against clockwork soldiers, so that might be handy. This is what I have for upgrading your equipment. That could be handy. Yeah, I think I'm going to go for that. Business. And into sleep dart, yeah, that could be handy. I've got loads of money. Stinging bolts. The situation in the Empire has driven the prices up. A deal well made. And it's, yeah, they could be handy. Yeah, I'll take that. I'm not sure about the fire bolts, so. Because I think I'll only be using them against blood fry nests, and um, I kind of can deal with them anyway. Sending bolt range, that could be handy. Yeah, that'll do for now. Let's see what you've got. Supplies. And... Stinging bolts. Yep, I'll take some of those. I need those. Stun mine, got three and three. Bullets don't use them. Sleep darts, oh yep. Ah, you see, I wish I had some more. Yeah, spring razors, yep, got those. Rune, yep, I'll take that, I think. Ooh, last time I got stiffed on that, but I might give that a go. Yeah, I'll, go, I'll give that a go. And that's rewire tool. Want one of those? <sighs> oh, we can only buy one. Okay. That's a I used to own a cafe down at the docks. But the smell 10. of fish blood was stronger than the smell of morning coffee. I had to sell it. Do find me again. Okay, quick save there. Yeah, I sold it by that. Why not? We've got loads of money, so it doesn't matter. I know, Keep I could shadows. find one, but That's just in case. Advice. And what's money for if you don't spend it, eh? <coughs> OK, 
Okay, rewire the wall of light. Enter the carriage station. Okay, uh, probably be coming to the end of this video fairly soon, so I'll just have a little wander around here and uh, see what I can find. Or find a natural stopping place anyway. Okay, rooms, rooms, bone charm 44. Two hundred and forty two meters, that's a long way away. Okay. That looks uh tempting up there. Let's go and have a look if we can. Oh maybe we can't. Okay, we'll try up there. There you go. Oh, is that better? Can we get from up there? Can we do it? Oh, that's good to know. Ah, oh, crap, I just bought one. Oh, nom nom. Okay. I'll remember that where that is if I need it. Okay. You see, that's the thing about this game, it's worth looking everywhere because you, you can you can find loads of stuff and they hide loads of stuff really well. Um, I mean, I guarantee I've, I've missed loads and loads of stuff. But, uh, hey. Yeah, very intriguing, very well done. You've really got to work in this game. And that looks to me like a beggar. Let's always give a beggar a coin. Quick save, just in case something bad happens. Hey, I'm appreciated. I'll let you in on a secret. That'd be very nice of you. I saw people coming and going recently, looking for whale oil, up to something. Okay, that's pretty damn obscure. All right, guys, anyway, we're coming up to round about the 40 odd minute mark. Um, so I think I'll probably call this to an end here. I uh, hope you're enjoying it. I certainly am. See you next video. Later. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please leave a like, leave a comment, and hit the bell next to the subscribe button after you subscribed, obviously. And don't forget to follow me on Twitter. See you later.